Okay, everyone, do you like monarch butterflies? Well, listen to this. The Cornell Cooperative Extension says the population of monarch butterflies is decreasing. One local woman has taken it upon herself to change that. Emily Noonan has the story. They fascinate me so much. I've been raising them for uh, about 10 years. Deborah Mistark will go out nearly right every day to collect eggs from her milkweed plants. I wanted to see if I could help them along. You know, it's, it's a small difference, but it's something. You take the eggs into a protective zone. Under my porch, if you want to see, like, everything I've done. She made her own butterfly room. This year was so crazy, I had to make two more. Deborah says this year, she released nearly 450 butterflies that are now on their long trek to Mexico, where they'll stay for the winter. I'll snip the leaf and tape them up there so they won't get, you know, fall. Unfortunately, an expert from Cornell Cooperative says reversing the decline is very doubtful, but Ms. Stark's efforts could slow down the process. Their winter habitat in Mexico is being destroyed. And with more people pulling milkweeds from their yard, there's not enough food to support the caterpillars. The milkweed is the only food source, and it's the only plant they lay their eggs on. So they need the milkweed then? Yes. She's hoping her efforts will inspire the town of Pittsburgh to use extra green space, like parks, to grow more milkweed. Emily Noonan, News 8. Experts at Cornell Cooperative, they say that many people choose not to keep the milkweed plant around because once it gets established in an area, it can be very difficult, if not impossible, to get rid of. 